Hello, in this video you will learn about different types of curves used in computer graphics. So first question is what is the importance of curves in computer graphics? That is why we need curves in computer graphics. In computer graphics you can see we draw different types of object on the screen and the objects are not flat. So in order to draw objects that are not flat, what we need? We need curves. For example, you can see we have different types of objects that are not flat. So in order to draw certain types of object, what we need? We need curves to draw objects that are not flat. Curves to draw objects that are not flat. Next is what is curve? Curve is just the large set of points. Here in curve, each point has two neighbors except the end point. We have three types of curves in computer graphics. That is implicit curve, explicit curve and parametric curves. Now let's see one by one what is implicit, explicit and parametric curve. In implicit curve, this is defined as the set of points on a curve by employing a procedure. You can see here, this is the example of implicit curve. We can use implicit curve for the representation of multi-valued curve. And this is the implicit representation for the circle. And you can see this is the function form for the implicit curve. Next is explicit curve. In case of explicit curve, they are single value. Here this is the mathematical function that you can use to plot explicit curves. And you can see here, this function is explicit representation of curves. It cannot represent vertical lines. So with the help of this function, we cannot draw the vertical lines. Next is parametric curve. Parametric curve, that is curves having parametric form known as parametric curves. In case of both implicit and explicit curves, we use function for the curve representation. What in practice, parametric curves are most widely used. Next is Bezier curve. This is discovered by the French engineer. Here you can see, so this curve can be generated under the control of other points. Here we are using tangent for the generation. We have different types of Bezier curve like simple Bezier curve. This is a straight line from the point. For example, you can see here, this is the example of simple Bezier curve. You can see this is nothing but just a straight line from the points. Next type is quadratic. Here it is controlled by three points. So you, this curve is determined by three control points. You can see here we have three control points for this curve. Next type is cube brazier curve. This is determined by four control points. You can see here we have four control points that is P0, P1, P2 and P3. Uh, next is spline representation. So first question is what is spline? This is thin wood or metal strip that we use for the building construction. In the industries like aircraft, automobile and ship building, the layout of the model can be shaped using curves. So this is done using a long narrow strip of wood, metal or plastic that is known as Loftman spline. In the computer graphics, we are using spline curves for the construction of different models. You can see here we have different varieties of spline curve used in different computer graphics application. Next is B spline curve. It is set of control points and it is linear combination of control points like pi and B spline as a basic function. So that's all about this video. That is we did different types of curves, implicit, explicit and parametric curves, spline representation. You can see here. So that's all about this video. If you have any question, you can comment below and, and thanks for watching this video.